Hello, I'm Dr. David Hornbrook, the Clinical Director of Education and Technology here at Keating Dental Arts in Irvine, California. You know, oftentimes when I'm around the world and, and people are asking me about the strength of the new zirconium dioxide here at Keating, it's the KDZ Bruxer. They ask me, how strong is this material? So I thought, you know what, let's do something fun. So I've got a few things in front of me, four to be exact. I've got a hammer. I've got a very, very hard piece of hardened wood. So this isn't pine or, or balsa, I'm not sure what it is. It's part of a wedge. So it almost looks like, like acrylic or hard, hard plastic, but it's actually wood. Then I have a KDZ Brux, or this is a monolithic zirconia crown. And then I have the PFM, the porcelain infused metal crown. So what I'm gonna do, we'll see if this works, I haven't done this yet before. I'm gonna put the PFN on this wood and I'm gonna hammer it. Well, I'm not going to say all my patients have the strength of this hammer. Well, a few of them might actually see in some of the dentition break in my practice, but you can see how it just blew the porcelain off the metal. All right, now I'm going to take the KDZ Bruxer against a monolithic zirconia. You can see through it like you couldn't even the PFM. I'm going to go ahead and put it right next to the PFM or close to it. And we're gonna go ahead and hammer this with about the same force. One. Oops, broke the wood. Ah, uh, that's very cool. So it's embedded, it's embedded there, finally got it out. No crack, not even the margins are cracked. So we'll put it back, let's see how many times we, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's beat up on the PFM a little bit more. Oh, lost some more porcelain. Well, I'm breaking the wood. So, are KDZ Bruxers? Strong? I'd say so. I didn't even chip a margin. These margins are only about a millimeter thick. Great restorative material. And that's why it's the fastest growing and the most popular indirect restoration in dentistry today.